Hi, welcome to RoboJax. In this video, I'm going to introduce the LDR or light dependent resistor, sometimes called also as photoresistor. This piece is a very important and very useful uh, passive component in electronic. Your cell phone has it, a lot of other equipment, it's being used in sensors and alarms, in automated system and robotics. So let's get started. The resistor, it has two pins, it has elements that are being, so as the light shines between the two terminals here, on this side and on the other side, so these are the two terminals, there are some chemicals in between them, then as the light shines, it allows the flow of current to be controlled by light. So there are two types of LDR. One type is that if when the light shines, the amount of current increases, or let me put it, as the light shines, the resistor, the resistance decreases, or the opposite, as the light shines, the resistor increases. So this is the type that when the light shines, the resistance decreases, so it passes more current. Just LDR, I did a search on LDR, as you can see here, these are the symbols that are shown. So you will see it in a uh, resistor like that, or you see a resistor and then surrounded by a circle and two arrows that shows the light is coming. So you might see different uh, symbol for it, but all of those, they refer to the same thing, which is LDR or light depending resistance. LDR can be used as a switch or as something that uh, for example, in your phone, when the intensity of light increases or decreases, it adjusts the, the sc uh, screen of your phone. So that is an LDR can be used there, or sometimes they use even a camera to capture the light and measure it. But generally, this can be done. For example, you can install this at your mm, garage door that during the day, the light is off, and during the night, the light will be on. So now I'm going to do is, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, put small LED or light emitting diode so we will turn it on and off. With this LED I will have to demonstrate how this is used. I will do two things. First I will measure it using a multimeter and cover this with my hand and we will see how the resistance changes. And then the next step I'm going to create a simple project with a transistor and then show you when we bring our hands over this it at a certain level or certain preset value that we set. So at a certain threshold or a certain level, the LED will turn on. And then when I remove my hand, the LED will go off. This will be an example of turning on and off a light. During the day, the LED should be off, which means when there is too much light, when there's enough light, the big bulb is off. When there is dark, then the LED or a bulb or a light will turn on. So let's measure this with multimeter first. This is analog multimeter, and this is the best one to measure a resistance. So let's measure this. My multimeter is set here at 10. So whatever I read there, it will be multiplied by 10. So let me bring it down. Now, this is around 50, and that's 100, 50, 60, 70. This is 70 times 10, so now we have 700 ohms. And let me cover it. You see, uh, when it's dark, the resistance increases. So that's 500 times 10, which is 5,000. Now it's at 500 at this point. Okay, now I'm shining a light here to see how it changes. So now it's around 500. As you can see, 50 times 10. Here is set at 10, so that's 500. Here and uh, So let me just put it directly here. As you can see, it has been 5 times... It's at 5, 5 times 10 is 50. So let me change it and put this in ohm now this is an ohm and if I connect it 
this is 580 ohm 0 0.58 kilo ohm so now that's the direction of light a little light I have from the top let me cover it so now we get 1.4 kilo ohm 1.5 1.8 3 kilo ohm 7 kilo ohm and if I fully cover it we'll get 4.5 kilo ohm so I'm using it so very close so 42 ohm 40 ohm so here is the circuit and from the top we have an LDR connected to the 5 volts and then we have 10 kilo ohm potentiometer the center point of potentiometer is connected to the base and also connected via 91 ohm resistor here that is 91 ohm so this is connected to the ground and here we will adjust it according to the light so this will turn on this uh, switch the transistor 2n 2222 there is one more two and the LED will be on so now as light is shining this mm, LED is on when I cover it the LED is off as you can see so this can be connected to a relay that can turn on a motor or something or a shaft or a uh, robotic arm to do something so this is one way that you can control a switch with LDR okay and now let's have a look at the opposite circuit okay in this case I've just switched the position of some of the items so 3.3 .3 kilo ohm at the top connected to 5 volts and then 10 kilo ohm potentiometer and then LDR now the light will turn on when you cover this up once you cover this when we make it dark the resistance increases when the resistance increases the voltage across this will increase as a result the transistor will turn on and the LED will turn on so uh, here that's the same circuit I've connected it at 3.3 .3 kilo ohm through this one at the, and this is connected to the right pin here and then from the middle one I have connected it to LDR and LDR is coming to the ground and then from the middle point which is LDR is connected I have connected it to the transistor here the sensitivity can be adjusted from here you see at this light level it's already on and then so you can adjust the sensitivity as you can see there is a little light now and if you want to totally darken it you can do so this was introduction to LDR with examples thank you for watching please thumb up the video and also don't forget to share it with your friends